Well, they did do it. I mean, that's the point. It's pretty obvious. They've admitted they did it, and they, they came clean about it. I mean, I guess the scariest part of all this, Senator, and um, look, these are words you use all the time. Uh, Tea Party, Patriot, you want to make America a better place to live. Uh, if you're critical of how the government is being run, the country's being run, you talk about the Constitution, the Bill of Rights. I'm surprised you weren't <laughs> investigated for that matter. <laughs> well, yeah, that's a pretty big group of people, those who have been critical of the government. You know, when I think of this thing, I think of what uh, Lincoln said. He says, you know, nearly any man can be tested and maybe meet up to adversity, but if you really want to test a man, give him power. I think in that sense, the president's failing that test of power because he has extraordinary power and he's supposed to be able to be wise enough to restrain himself. But he's using the power of government to investigate his enemies. He's tapping the phones of the press. And it turns out last year he signed legislation that allows him to detain an American without a trial and send them to Guantanamo Bay. This sounds like a president somewhat drunk on power, not cautious about how he uses power. All right, so we power. got the IRS.